Okay, we've got South Point linebacker Davian Miranda Carrasco here with us. He's the Impact Award winner for the Ed Doherty Award uh, ceremony, which has to deal with community service. And before we started this, he was going to a list of things he's done in the community. So I'm going to have to ask you again, just because it's a long list. So what have you done? What are some of the things you've done for the Tucson community? Uh, I've done a couple of things, and uh, I like to, I run a local reselling business selling shoes and uh, vintage clothing, and I like to do it uh, through my business. But uh, starting off with last year, around this time during the uh, holiday season, I uh, helped out two families uh, in need and got uh, both families some Christmas gifts and a couple just Christmas essentials. And then um, I recently did, or when we started, when we went back to school, I did uh, two students, a boy and a girl, Got them their school supplies, got them a bit of uh, school essentials, and um, recently as well did a Thanksgiving uh, box drive where I helped out five families with the turkey and all the sides and fixings. And um, as well as I've helped out with uh, a couple programs, um, one of them being we used to do a memorial uh, for my Theo Angel where we used to hold uh, basketball tournaments, and as well with that, give back. And that's a bit of where my um, drive comes from to give back and uh, as well with like Casa uh, Casa uh, Maria and I, I think that's the name and there's a couple other ones that I've done as well but uh, yeah just trying to do as much as I can because uh, Tucson's been so good to me and, and they uh, man I've been blessed with so many opportunities yeah so you're a senior so now you're gonna go on to college what, what do you want to uh, I mean is it gonna be around you know the community type of thing you want to do in school uh, you know community service and uh, you know. So I, I want to go to college and pursue a business management degree yeah. and um, my life goal is to hopefully continue my business now and make it a brick and mortar or make it something bigger than it is and um, and as well as trying to start my own um, nonprofit organization. That's something that I've always wanted to do and I hope to strive to get to that point. Yeah. What, what's your business name? Uh, Prolific Plugs. Prolific Plugs. Plugs, okay. Yep. And how long has this been going on? Uh, it's been going on since I believe I was a freshman in high school, so a little bit over three years now. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And again, the impetus is your your family. Uh, you know, uh, who is, who exactly again got you involved in this? Um, so I I've, I've always had a love for shoes uh, since I was very young, and to be very honest, uh, my dad is has always been a really big help. But he's taught me a lot of things. Um, that's gotten me to this point and one of those being that when I was young um, I could only ever buy one pair of Jordans for the school year so I would take really good care of them uh, come the next school year we would list them up on eBay get some money back for them and um, and then buy and go and buy another pair of Jordans so that kind of started it all uh, I think at a young age I had a reseller mindset uh, and with my mom being a real estate agent I kind of we're just in a family full of, of business people, so uh, I would say that's where it started. But uh, I mean, just the Jordans and with a lot of these Nikes coming out, I I, I just have a huge love for them. Great, great. And you, you had a great season as a football player too. What sticks out in, in my mind is your sack there against Desert Edge, right, toward the end. Yeah. Uh, you and Coley had those two sacks back to back. So you went out, you know, the years your end of your career you really came on strong so just talk about your football career how um, that went for you and it was an amazing four-year run uh, at South Point I thank South Point for um, always being so good to me and for believing in me um, going into my junior year I I almost didn't make varsity uh, I thank coach Berg and coach Rogers for um, for just giving me that opportunity and allowing me to get uh, to a certain point where I was, I was able to put on the pads and show that I could go in, go in and play linebacker. So um, my junior year uh, statistically was a bit better. Uh, I played a key role. I played weak side linebacker, and then coming into senior year, went over and played strong side back here. And um, although my statistics may have gone down this year, uh, I still played a very big role. I know yeah. you guys know that we run a, um, a three-three stack, so. Uh, I'm a B-gap filler. Uh, I stopped the B-gap, allowed Joey to run free. Uh, Connor plays a huge role in our defense as well. So uh, although I wasn't, you know, out there doing crazy things, um, I just, I, I take pride in being able to do the little things so that our team can 
have a, a bigger goal like making it to a state championship. Yeah, and I'm sure your senior leadership played a big part too. Oh yeah, so. I, I, I love my team, man. That was that was an amazing team. All the young guys, uh, I have a great amount of love for them. They know that they can come to me whenever they need me, and um, I'm always gonna be there for them. And I believe like the last uh, the last interview we did um, at the state game, I reminded that my goal was not, I mean, it would have been great to win the state game, but my goal is from years to now to be able to connect with these guys and, and just be that person that can just give advice or help wherever I can. I mean, ultimately that's, you know, football is just, at the end of the day, it's just a game, man. And if you can connect and build our relationships outside of football, and that's, the real world is where, you know, it gets tough. So um, just trying to just be that person for my team. Well, we're gonna we're gonna hear a lot about you, I'm sure, as you go on in the Tucson community. We're gonna, your name's gonna be out there for all you do for Tucson. So, best of luck and congratulations on your honor with the Adority Award, with the Impact Award, and uh, in your career at South Point. Thank you so much. I Thank appreciate you. it. Thanks, Dave.